Yes, welcome to the Jamaica Young Police Channel. To our loyal viewers, subscribers and Patreon members. At the channel, we are a group of law-abiding citizens who believe in the rule of law and respect the rights of every citizen. But not the ones who do not subscribe to such behavior. We do believe in and support preemptive strikes because they save lives. This is a logical conclusion because preemptive strikes save lives and prevent the further loss of lives. We are all about saving lives at this channel. We at the channel aid criminals with a passion and do not want them over here. We do not want your views, your subscriptions, your likes or your comments. Please go elsewhere where the red carpet is waiting for you. Over here, we want you to go to prison or the departure lounge. At Madden. Yeah, so if this is the first time here at the Jamaica Young Police Channel, we highly recommend subscribing to stay updated with our latest content. Hit the subscription button above, click the bell icon and select all to receive notifications whenever we at the Jamaica Young Police Channel release a video. Remember that this channel is not an entertainment channel. You know, entertainment channels give you a hybrid between 10 to 15 minutes. This is not an entertainment channel. So you have to go elsewhere if you want entertainment. Remember to give this video a thumbs up because you will find it helpful and informative. Please remember to share the video with your girlfriend, your boyfriend, mama, papa, side chick or side man and tell them to tell a friend about the Jamaica Young Police channel. You can join the Patreon squad by doing so you will gain access to exclusive content that cannot be played on YouTube due to various restrictions. To unlock this untapped collection of videos, click the link in the description box below. Joining our Patreon community allows you to explore contents that complies with laws, rules and regulations while avoiding disruption to our channel's functionalities. You'll be able to see videos and you'll see photos, photographs, names of persons who have been killed and are and still waiting on justice like Rifle of the British crew, one of the British of the, uh, of the British crew and you'll see the people who are involved in the killing of these men and others including Douglas Chambers who was killed by PMP criminal organization members and it, it came from the top and to date the person, our person who have given, given that order has not been arrested and charged for that murder. So you can go to Patreon and you'll be able to see the face and name of those person. So thanks for your continued support and we look forward to providing you with exceptional content. So moving on to today's video. Yes, yeah, so as we always said, you know, um, we at the Jamaica Young Police Center, we hit criminals with a passion, even thieving police, and thieving police officers do not like us. And look, we don't care. We have no problem sending people to the departure lounge because we believe in a preemptive strike because it saves lives. Some of these people cannot be redeemed, and they're just irredeemable, especially people who are the hell bent on destroying other people's lives. And, you know, they decide that you're supposed to work and take care of them some way or the other. So you have heard, you have heard, you know, me says on so many occasions that I do not like thieving police officers. Yes, and there are so many reasons why I do not like them or want them around me. They are very dishonest, corrupt, disloyal and criminals in uniform. These, are de these people bring the force into disrepute and law enforcement of, um, officers. You know, discredit, um, cause people to discredit the police and cast them, use a brush and paint the entire police force, which is bad. So, you know, at this channel, you know, that's, you know, you're in a dopey story. You just, you know, you will hear testimony from people, um, you know, police officers, even civilians who are not afraid to speak truth. Because the thing is that only, the only thing that you can be liars with is with the truth. And they think that is everybody, um, um, everyone is afraid of them. It's not everyone is afraid of people who are criminals. You know, some people, they know that it's only one like You can't kill me today, but you cannot kill me tomorrow. And you know that we will love the police in every jurisdiction. 
Um, we live in our country and we're not going to pretend like there's not racism in America. Racism exists in everywhere in America. But you understand what I'm saying? So we're not going to say that um, the police, some of some of the police in, police in America are not racist. So we're not going to use a, a brush and paint the entire police um, police departments in America. Because we, have, we ourselves, um, yes, we have done... We have, yes, we are, you know, if there was certain things, would I be a deputy in a certain department? Because we have done everything, completed everything and one and two little things. But due to our injuries after, um, due to what happened to us in the military, you know, that's prevented us from, uh, you know, from um, transition from the military to that um, agency. And we have no regrets. So we're happy where we're at now because we're in a better place right now. So you're going to hear from a former member of the Jamaican Constabulary Force. He used to, he used, he used to be stationed at Unspear Police Station. And he will tell you so many things about corrupt police officers. Yes, corrupt police officers who were thieves. Yes, thieves. So in the 1980s, yes, there are so many things. In the 1980s, two police officers from Unspear Police Station, their detectives, went to Two Miles, Kinson 13. Two miles is where um, two miles intersect with um, Dela Cree, Dela Cree Park. Um, that's a housing scheme, and it, um, it intersects with um, you know you go down Union Garden, Union Gardens, Crescent Road, and Cool Lane, and all all these places, both island. You understand? So in the nineteen eighties. You know, um, and these two police officers, detectives, yeah, so they went out at two miles to a betting shop to extort, uh, you know, to extort or uh, collect money from the owner of an illegal betting shop in the community. So what some police officers used to do, you know, they used to, people, yeah, back in the 80s, even I, even when I was at Unspear, people operate illegal betting shop um, all over the community. I just don't mess with them people because, you understand, that's not me. Because that's not, you know, they are breaking the law, but no, uh, that is not my portfolio my portfolio is to fight crime you know find guns make sure the communities are safe and all of that you know that wasn't me if a pursue people where i sell um illegal you know betting because people who are selling illegal betting if there was no market for it they would not be you know just like with drugs but that's not my job so you have police officer who deal with these kind of thing but you have some other police officer this is not their speciality but anything with money you understand them going there. So so what happened now is that <laughs> these two thiefing police have on spear. One of them are know him, you know, so you go to hear it. And so they went to the community now to rob or extort the man and um you understand. The the, the betting shop in our community, you know, and it's a part of Unspear police area. So you know them walk or you know they, them walk from Unspear. That's like about uh, about two mile walking. So what, what both police officers were about to do was illegal. So they were doing this on them own, thiefing police in us. Most times the police get trouble. But they went to the business, you know, to shake down the owner. So and entering the betting shop, <laughs> the policeman who was in front of the other policeman walked into an arm robbery. So I, them, you know, I rob a police, you know, got robbed, you know. What was a rob? Because extort or shake down are still robbery. So they walk into them have them gun panel minute. So they walk into a robbery. You understand? <laughs> so the what the policeman who was in front, instead of challenging the gunmen them that had robbed the place, he pick up both feet and start to run when one of the gunmen shot him in the back. And when the other policeman who you know who was a detective too, lost his train of thoughts. He lost him train at heart, you know. So he wasn't thinking or for respond. And he might try to run to one, a gunman them shot him in his body. And then them jump, a gunman them jump over them, not even finish them, because they realize they are police. But you're going to hear everything, we're not gonna delve in it. So the other story, guess what? Boy, if you know about Everton Beatty story, boy, the story is totally different. So you're gonna hear for other policemen um who bought a a Capri motor car from convicted murderer Everton Beachy Stout McDonald. 
for three thousand dollars pay him for it and you know, get all of the paperwork and then the same policeman borrow back the money from beach Stout and never pay him back or not even a cent which means that this man got a car free from beach Stout. can you believe it you can't make up these things so what kind of police officers are these men you know so you know in this eye opening you will hear some shocking first hand accounts of corruption and criminal activities of thieving police officers a former member of the Jamaica Constabulary Force stationed at Unspear Police revealed the nefarious deeds of dishonest and disloyal officers who engage in criminal behavior. So you're going to hear that for yourself. You know, one horror in tail involved police officers attempting to extort money from an illegal betting shop only to stum stumble upon armed robbery. Instead of confronting the gunman, one, poli one officer cowardly fled, resulting in a tragic outcome. And as we tell you about another disturbing incident involving a policeman who not only purchased a car from BT Stout but also borrowed money from him and never repaid it. <laughs> These two shed lights on unethical and despicable action of you know those sworn to uphold the law. So the police force has come a long way, you know. So I want you watch, you listen and you decide. Trust me, you're going to enjoy listening to these stories. You know, so I'm most police after them retire after five years, them dead. Yeah, man, because I'm a 41 years me doing it, you know, so I joined it from me at 19. Oh, okay. But you see, during the time when me, when me in it, yeah. me always look and say, what if anything should have happened and me have to lose the work when I would have resort to? Mm, no. So during that time, me, me go learn to do some bully for something, you know. Mm. Uh, yeah, man, and that include going to America Motors. I, I spend most of my time at traffic department, you know. Yeah. So I did actually go for my own down America Motorcycle Institute, mm -hmm. the watercraft division on a day to one beach, so when we learn to fix jet ski and speedboat. Mm -hmm. Then we go back yeah man, then we go back again and go learn to fix motorcycle. Yeah. Then we go back again and go learn to do a small engine mechanic. And then we go me go like Jaggers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> got, yeah, I got all that stuff. I got Jaggers. I actually go a CPTC production and video. So I have a lot of things to really keep oh, me what? So you, you, you know a production thing to man? Yeah, man. I mean, I'm playing on the piano too. Why you rounded, man? I give thanks, man. So all, of, uh, so all, of, all of your years, most of your time of traffic you spend it? Most of the time I spend it. After me leave St. Andrew's South, well, we leave on beer. Which which year, which year, which year, which year left once beer? We left once beer eighty four. I'm going to Patrick City. Oh, oh, oh okay. We spent two years at Patrick City, and then we transferred to Portland. We served Portland Division. Two years after I come to Portland, we go up on the motorcycle traffic section. Oh, oh, oh. So, okay, so, oh, so, you, so, you, so, you, so you know, you know what thing they do. Um, where I come from? Where, where? In, 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 you see that once beer and them thing in a general office. Who, who that no weird? No man, no weird. The one before weird. Ah, uh, how we used to do the first? Um, Michael. No man, no Michael. I don't uh, remember his name right now. Him, him up, him up, uh, him up, him, him, him did I become detective and them thing there after? Eh. Uh, mm. Him come, him come, uh, me, me him come from Portland. <laughs> him come from Saint Mary. Uh, Oh, St. Mary. Mm. I don't know that. I know, all right. I remember mean, down there. Let me tell you what I did. Like, he was Henry Simmons. Yeah. In a general, in you know, a general, general office. Okay. Mm. I'm mean, not certain how that. But you know, Henry Simmons. No, I don't remember. Mean, mean, uh -uh. All right. You, you know, uh, you know, all right. You didn't know one where they done any in King Davis, Silver Fox? No. Uh, I go on to be in 92. Yeah. Uh, 92. Mm. Okay. So where you used to be before? Me used to be at St. Elizabeth. Me used to be at Clarendon and St. Elizabeth. Okay. Mm. Oh, you go down there when Cowboy and um, Phipps and them no, and them, there. No, no. Co them come there. Cowboy come there. Come see me. Cowboy did come off a suspension when him, when him come out once. When him come out once, him come see me. I, him, okay. Yeah, that's how him just get off a murder, murder case and... In the dark, come out of uh, in the dark, come out of foreign pan sickly fan, a uh, Mexican user too before and lick him down and him did in the hospital. <laughs> the, in the, the man that the pan sickly for foreign and a work, you know. 
And then when the man they become up in a rank now, they want to kill police or thief or foreign. And him did that foreign every six months, he used to do foreign work for a construction site. You understand? Mm. Mm. You yeah, better th- believe it, eh? I saw them stay up. That's why I'm not, you know, I mean, you know, them people that me can't rate them because they're hypocrites. You know? So that means you must know Jonah Thomas and Affleck then? Yeah, man. Eh, uh, African, Af- African, Af- 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 we have a group of African, you know? Eh? Yeah, man. We have a group uh-huh. of African, um, African, Dudley Bryan, John Gaz, and all the big man, Ivan O. Thompson and all them, man. Alright, Ivan O. Thompson was a, was a, um, I know the one, um, in the sergeant when I don't have honesty, yeah? mm. Devon Simpson, the inspector, the um, inspector, yeah. Lester Owell, the sergeant, mm-hmm. Mr. Dwyer, the, the DDI, then time when I never have no deputy superintendent. Yeah, man, yeah, 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 man, because even me, the CIB, I, I went Macmillan become we have crime chief. And the first yeah, crime yeah, chief, yeah. the first crime chief we get was Tom Levine, and he was assistant so. Tom, Tom Levine was assistant super, we a shaky hand with him, we lip a gold pendant. Man, he that's it. Yeah, man, <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. at them, man, I met my giant police work, you know. So, uh, me, you like you say you come from Rona, Rona where? Rima? No, nah, man, a June Stone, I come from. Okay, Rona June Stone, mm, okay. Yeah, man, Tom Levine is hey. my idol, man. At them, man, I met my giant thing, you know. <laughs> I mean, you talk about Kojak too. Kojak a thief, man. Yeah, man, I mean, never know him when I was on me, but I know him when he come to Portland. Mm, I'm a thief, man. Thief in police. Yeah. And, and him and Bud Spencer, they were one time when they shot him in the head. Yeah, man, Bud Spencer a thief. Bud Spencer a thief, too. You know what I'm saying, then? Yeah, man, I know, man. Then all he made me like, like pies, you know. In the, in yeah, man, then they didn't have COVID, man. Mm, I'm a thief, man. They never, they, all right. Um, you did that one. That one down there when it, I don't know. I don't know what I'm telling you. Know. Um, one when you in Jimbo. I don't know. I don't know. One you, you didn't know the Lawrence brother, Lexi Lawrence. No, mm. Gail, Le- Juicy Gail, and I wanted that Gail. The two of them down there as brother, that CIB. Mm-mm, no, when me, when me did no Gail ever did it. Uh, yeah, well, they would know. All right. Me you talk about Essen. Yeah, man, Simon Essen. Thief. Simon Essen. Thief. Yeah, then what about your what about your uncle? The, him the DC and your uncle that special Carney. Carney at Essen at Essen family? Yeah man and, and uh, something there you now. The DC where you so drive the car down there when you want it. Where you so walk and hop. But people always believe say my superintendent. The, you know. Yes, and that, and that everybody always tell me. What him there? Them same that foreign. <laughs> Me no know which part in there. Me no know which part in there, brother. Mm. Them say, them say, yeah. him, them say, him behave like I in my soup, and, and people used to think say my soup for you. Yeah, because when you go down there, you, know, you pick up, you need that one Benz, and you pick you up in the Benz and carry you go down at the business place. So, true, everybody know him as a superintendent now. Then just believe, say, you are one young police when you come to you, say, too. Mm. Mm. And um, who, who am I so far down there? You see, two DC, the two of them dead to us. Mackenzie and Stuart. Stuart, they did run an Olympic yard when Sandra can read around there. Mm. And Mackenzie, they did up a Maxfield Children's Home. I just unfortunately him did it. And somebody seen with one gun. And Carl. And they, um, when the mobile reserve man then go up, they then take the back fence and I climb. Put one of them put up a gun on the wall and I go up and Mackenzie seal. And think a criminal and fire and fire. And I tell the same man, I walk up the six pants for them to rat him. Mm. But him didn't have plain clothes, you know. Mm. Don't know how, don't know how history plays, man. Mm. <laughs> but you're you, you hold it well. You, hey, when you start out, you can't kind of start out shaky, you know. Oh, but me- then I tell the same you, you develop some courage and you, 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 you lick the nail them from the head right away, man. Uh, why why you say me start out cheeky? Okay? Yeah, to me, you never did have much confidence. When, well, maybe because of the first me that listened to you when I first hear it. I mean, yeah. I say, yeah, I thought, like, you know, you, you, you know, once a certain thing. True, true, true. Know, yeah, yeah, true. Uh, yeah, man, let me, let me pick up that man and then realize you develop the courage now. Mm. And you start to express yourself freely without fear. Or yeah, man. Because, yeah, we, no, look, in, in our life and them thing, we, we do think, we, we know the thing because we want nobody to like we and them thing. Because you understand? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Yeah, man, where I say, where I say I true and them thing, man? 
Yeah, yeah man. But remember what I tell you when we don't have one spear there, you know, when the bulletproof vest just come in, you know. We never... One brother named Ken, mm. Ken Rice, send it Fox, Oma Davis. Same like the man don't have man take a vest. Two of them have the same name. Mm. Oma Davis put on the bulletproof vest and grow on the back of the cell there. And um, Ken Rice, send it. Tell himself if you try it and can rifle see it. Fire the shot in a vest or at it and fax drop a gun. Believe saying get shot. And see him Tom Living come around there and say I got charged. Fax attempt suicide and I got charged. Can rise see it for attempt murder. One piece of something long there. Mm. Whatever matter, they just laugh it off as jokes still. Mm. That's all madness. But, was. Yeah man. Um I would you may tell somebody one girl over I sell I put on to you know, I tell her, I say, when my dad owns me, I hate the man down there, so. You have to know the whole of them name, because me, see, the, you want them tell you, you could have just go for operation, and you just pick up some people and collect them up a cell. And I say, man in a cell charged with murder, and I make noise, say that they pick him up in an operation, and they not do nothing and them for processing. Then tell them, we don't even call it process, you just check out. Mm-hmm. And then come and let out the man with charge for murder, you know, and the man gone, you know, and then two days after, you know, the man will really get picked up in the, um, the raid, you know, start ball out, say, what am I doing this so long, you know, that time they realize, say, uh, the wrong man get let go, you know. <laughs> so from that time, no. <laughs> yeah, man, then time, they know, you have to just, <clears throat> when you sell, you all do three months on a cell there, for you have to know a prisoner, them by their name. Mm-hmm. And by them face. Eh, so, you know, whole book. I'm going to say, go call my name, and you, know, you go and say, tell me your name. I just take it off in my book. From man, we have some for you. Mm. Mm, that's true, man. Eh? Eh. But if you write one book and release it, release it still. <laughs> yeah, yeah, true. Mm, the journey. Or some, get some name about the ghetto there, man. Yeah, man. Because mm. I only pass a story we have, you know. Uh-huh. Mm. As, I'm telling you, there was once one squad that don't have once been named. Primus. Primus. Primus, yeah. And then one, uh, yeah, one out of them to name Vigilant, yeah, when the two squad book up, man. Well, when I turn um, Pain Avenue and Maxil Avenue, man, boy, boy, I run up and down, man. Mm. Then they have a jump. Yeah, yeah. Mm. It, you know, some police are used to work without fear still, you know. Yeah, man. Me, um, and then gen, genuine people, them. Mm. Man, I did love the work on them thing there. Yeah, mm. But you see if where you did, though? Yeah, man. I see if I live, I live on a military base, you know. Okay, well, that is great. That is great. Mm. Mm. Yeah, mm. I understand. Mm. We should live a guy. We should live a guy. You have, to, you have to have a military ID for coming to me there. You can't, well. <laughs> you can't even just come, come mm. visit me, so on them thing there. You understand? Yeah, eh. Yeah. Mm. 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 Merita, I'll tell you the truth. When me have 1,000 days living at the force, you know, me start to count it, you know, that people are building. I say, oh, me just eager to believe the force. So me say, you have a plan for separation. Mm-hmm. You have a plan for leave the organization. Yeah. And then me did, me did start to do some little work for my own and all of them, something the family no say. Enough of the people them who you usually have run you when you were a serving member. You know, God Those them, are not your friend no more because they cannot get any favor from you. Yeah, man, in a second, man. Start, yeah, man, I'm going to start preparing myself for all of them things, my brother. Mm. 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 But me no real, me never subscribe to you or something, you know, me just have face, search for it on YouTube and find it every time you put up something. But I'm going to do a subscription now still. Mm. Mm. So, you, you, how do you call it now? You monetize a channel, you're getting reward from it? Yeah, man, yeah, we monetize it and everything there. But okay, not, wonderful. Yeah, but we don't not, not, not do, not do it for make money and everything there. Because if we don't do it for make money, you know, like how you have an like hour or two hour video, we don't just, you know, because uh-huh. all of them are on YouTube where, you know, them call you and I say, boy, you know, we are, we are doing a disservice to each channel because we should not make it at, you know, the, the most 15 minutes. But we are telling him that that's entertainment, <laughs> we know an entertainment thing. You know, you yeah, just a reveal, you reveal the truth. Mm. Yeah, God, yeah, you understand what I'm saying? So that's why, that's why it's some, that's why it's some, some of them don't have to increase them time because people, you understand? 
Because it make sense. Mm-hmm. It make sense. If if you're in a this just to make money and them thing there, you know me. You know, I just me just want. I just life. Me want to save. I me just want to change Jamaica. Me just want. Me just want about the country. Me used to. You understand? At least in the eighties and them thing there. I even make it better. But remember, so from and 1989, and things just start getting worse in a Jamaica, you know? And then something like your satisfaction and make you have peace of mind when you really yes. deal with the facts and deal with the things we really. May I tell you, man, for real, uh, I true, man. Go I, towards I, humanity and all of them, something like that. Yes. Yeah. Uh, mm. So, you know, so I do this and uh, uh, on about the money and them things, because. I want to tell, I want to tell you, say, you know, you see, like all when all a man all seventy five or eighty call and a man I say, boy, you know, a young boy, you know, say everything where you say a true and them thing, and then me tell me, he me tell, you understand, and then me carburetor uh-huh. me I say, and the man I say, boy, you know, say me feel good for no say, boy, you know, free for talk the things, just like what you say, you understand, you know, see. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Well, I only, mm. pa, I only, any minute, the middle having the police force, you know, you understand, only. <laughs> uh, yeah man, cause enough police, enough police like me man, because I want to tell you, say, I, I don't know if you do a weather burn when that on spear, him dead you know? Weather burn was what rank? He was a detective, detective, cons, um, detective carpal, him dead about three weeks now you know, him you said, him, him <laughs> dead on the channel you know, if you go on the channel and listen what the man say, the man say, uh, the, uh, let me tell you, the man hide you know, say, in you know, the 70s up to when Siago win you know. When you have police, you have to be uh-huh. thief for once behind them. I tell you, you, know, you have to be thief. The man said they used to thief all the tire them off of the car. Thief, gas, all kind of something. Just listen to it. And it's no shame on them things. Nah. And that's why they don't like Siaga. He said it, you know. Say when Siaga uh-huh. win, when Siaga win Barnaby, I don't know if you know Detective Barnaby, he used to have sent on the central. I don't know if he's dead. He's uh-huh. smoke one black brother. He, he, he depends on the channel. The man said when Siaga win Barnaby, he said, Bum, buckler. How are you going to manage now, man? Because a fucking man come down a man can't home. Yeah, I, I, that that thing man I tell me, you know, man. You understand? Because them times, uh-huh. you, never, you never used to have no... Uh, what, what, uh, you never used to have no logbook for your vehicle, them, so... All for your day, one, all for your day, one police vehicle, all ten times the tank full, because the police, them are empty uh-huh. gas out of your vehicle, the service vehicle, for them vehicle. You understand? And, you know, you know, say, um, when you don't, when you don't, I get to the, and you never have to be criminal like that, you know, but there are so many things we can live off of making an honest bread, you know, I'll do it with risk, you know, because full time I own me, and as we don't work, you know, is it our whole one Guinness truck, our one DNG truck, and gang, and do an escort, you know, mm. and you like get one little money for yourself. You can go do, and then time they, it come in like either hide and do it, but it did genuine. Because me used to control one place, don't have Twitter and close any and Dakasta brothers, you know. Yeah. Me and the same Macken- Mackenzie and Stuart. I don't know, so we used to go hustle and time when we now work. Mm. But to be honest, <laughs> we never usually get the pay with self, which usually come to our superintendent when he had words and him usually pay with. We know certain how much money we usually get so with him. So I rob him, 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 I when you know when I think <laughs> it is just so hard when in the day when we don't have on spare one Saturday morning. What could what usually happen, you know, you see in the ghetto there, then you usually have a whole lot of illegal betting shop. Yeah man, so and the police they usually go at the betting shop them go and <laughs> go get a hustling. Boy, I mean, I mean, so I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I but I got to tell you what on Saturday morning. Mm. One detective when near Williams, when near Jimbo Williams, mm-hmm. and one next Watson going out and betting shop. Oh, oh, out of two, ma- out of two miles? Yeah, and they might rob the betting shop. The police, oh, and the boy, they might rob the betting shop? Yes, and then the police, then when Williams going there, she said, I rob a gun in the know. Train up and have illegal runnings. You know, challenge him and him run out of the shop and then shot him in the back. And when he drop a gun, Watson go over him and say, Jimbo, you get shot. And then shot Watson too, you know. And him not killing him. That's a DK Watson. Jump. Yeah, DK Watson. Mm. And the boy then jump over them and run gun. And Jimbo, they get crippled and work in a half a tree. Um, traffic office, you know. Mm. I said, my belly great, me that day, man. I said, well, but look how the man could have given them life, man. So, and, because so, of fear. And, and, and DK no killing on that boy, them? In care, you know, no frightening, frightening, get shot in him, but um, 
Hey, hey. Suppose, suppose me tell you something. Mm. When me, when me just get transfer, come on, on here. May I tell you? Yeah. Just like how you talk about DK. I may I tell you so. Me just get transfer from Saint Elizabeth. Come on, on here. I may I say DK, uh, car DK. Now you know, say my wife, we, we him kind of twist up him face. You know. Yeah man, he always and, a one punch in my hand. Yeah, and 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 and, and him and him always have like toothpick in his mouth, you know. Cause him smoke. Yeah man, and eh. him smoke. Eh. And he's a man him wear him him wear him dark as and chew him a trim. And eh, mm -hmm. eh, when me used to see them man then, and when we go, I may say, and chew him a while he extended matic, you know. Me as I me as I yeah young, me as I say, hey, this a brother you're supposed to be man in I in I in I in I office, you know. You saw me, you saw, mm -hmm. yeah, in my one next one year, Mr. B. But you saw me take a stack in a long run, I told, I told joke at them and them thing. Me I say, I joke at them, man. I'm a joke, man. Yeah, tell them. But you know, say, but you know, say, but, but, I never saw me didn't hear the story, me didn't hear the story, say, the police, the police did get shot and, and DK run left him, him DK get shot in a body and run left the police. No, no, I take him, I take him up, man. Me did it Saturday morning, you know. Mm. When you go in them bed, though? Yeah, man, then they have to eventually have to do that. Mm, mm, they got no doubt about it, man. Then they perish, man. Mm. Uh, man, <laughs> police get arrested already, you know. Yeah. And, and judge no one give them bail, you know, and police. Same crime, most and vigilante, drive good on the Supreme Court, you know. And Callum, I, I go get Callum number because he have a bullet more history about the on speed. Eh? Mm. He, live, he live near to me. And police go down like a crank up gun, you know. And both of them. The they never fire no shot, but the judge said, and second thought, I will consider bail. Mm. And so some of the police, they use the, the unit one time, man. So what? what, what? Back to, mm. Yeah, man, go on, sir. Don't go back to don't go back to you know, one place down there when you're a socialist giant, you know, man. Yeah. A five man gets shot in a, in a bar, the, in a giant, the one night, you know, brother. Five man dead in there, you know. Mm. But we know you know, we know, you know reflection for all of them, something there. So who did kill them? A man from Unsbill, you did kill them, no? Unsbill, you man, they come over. For Unsbill, you did man, they did not live right. Me know, man, me know, yeah. But, and, no, but, and, but, but them, they well, did go, go over Unsbill, you know, and kill man, and the man in retaliate. Yeah, man, they retaliate, eh? Mm. Because mm. uh, yeah. I'm not even in my life or I'm dead, you know. I'm brother, me and him in a police, him come from down the name, him named Fred Beckford. The man, he man want thief in boy named Dugo, our brother, and them thing, and them kill Dugo. Mm. Mm. <laughs> but, but, but the funny thing about it, you know, you know, so <laughs> I don't have any much sense neither, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, so I didn't live at 12, I didn't live at 12 Mary Avenue, you know, right side of the jungle, them places, you know, Volcano land, you know, Volcano. Yeah, uh, how's where you come from? What country you come from? I St. Thomas, I come from, you know. Oh, 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 so you got that trick for the other day? No, I never, me, you know, so I never did that. Mm. Eh, yeah, my virgin, I come and tell me, say, Dadrick, I'm buried, Dadrick, and I need that for now, but I never did that. That's so nice. But I grew up, me, but I grew up at a central village in a, in a cell in Lane, you know. Mm. So I never really free that lane. And Brennerton Avenue, all of them places. Me so you, you used to live at 12 Mary Avenue? 12 Mary Avenue. You're lucky. 12 Mary Avenue. You're lucky they didn't kill you, you know. Cause you understand? 12 Mary Avenue. Half a Spanish stone. You know Mary Avenue, man. Yeah. Hey. Hey. And one boy will throw up a pin avenue to go on bike from me one time in Dopey Sock. He'll take your bike from you? Yeah, man, I give one bike for fixing and they have, the, they have a bike up a um, Pain Avenue right up and down and I tell some more my bike and they say I feel comfy. But show me no why I don't know why with no man with no bike, I never they go up there. Oh, so your police are free to go for your bike? <laughs> yeah, just one of them things there. One, sit, one incident did happen up on um, Mary Avenue, up on Pain Avenue where I had to pitch one boy when I tell you. So I said, I didn't go up there, I just have to make a rest. Why didn't I kind of cool it down? Jeep, I said, it's it justifiable, but it never did all that justifiable. So I just, they just take a back seat on it. Hey, so what I tell you, uh, so, uh, you saw up a PNF when you were on them thing there. From, from, hey. from 1993, the boy was shooting, they were shooting off of me up there, me and Bobby, you know. Hey. Yeah, man. Them you know, you know, so then they shot Warren Clark up there, too. Yeah, man, in them foot, yeah. But you know, say my teeth, though. Yeah. 
<laughs> All right, I won't be a saying come from. Yeah, man. Yeah. So you know, you know that. You know, say, you know, say them fight. You know, say um. Narcotics police sign coke, find coke, six key of coke and light bill and all them things in a female name in a coke in a in a coke coke dealer pl- um, place and a female name upon the light bill. All right, eh? Yeah man. And then man they go and then yeah. man they used to go and squeaky clean, you know. Eh, eh, yeah man. Eh. Is that brother me not de- <laughs> talk to you, you know, from ninth uh uh me, uh me know the man the friend the man they are cancer between them things and when the man a deputy soap and him, uh, uh, and him the flying squad. You understand? But you know, say any police where the man bungles are, are bungles are friend. You know, say a thief them. Uh, yeah, so my bungles. Uh, so me see him long and me feel good, you know, can get deputy soup long and them thing there. I see him and I say, uh, what well, And I like say, me have squad and them thing there where in a soup, even me a constable and them thing there. But you don't know them have connection, you know, because I mean, I mean, I mean, I uh, I don't go out there and thief in nobody. I never, you understand? I don't have no drugs business. I don't I keep no drugs in my yard and all of them something for nobody. You understand what I'm saying? Man have them friends and them things, a man get them promoted. So, you don't know, I see them as squad, them on my squad, and I see them publicly. But yeah. I, I, I talk to them like a squad, but you don't know, you see them amongst junior ranks, you have to show them them respect, you know? You understand? Simple, yeah, 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 that is expected. Mm. Yeah, so I see the man and them thing there, and Warren Clark, and I see man, I say, What go on, Warren? And I, I like nobody. I hear the man said to me, say, <laughs> I hear the man, um, Detective Porter, um, the name is DSP Cl- um, Warren Clark, okay? I say, All right, sir, I say, All right, sir. I say, Boy, I never know, say DSP, they pay a bird service ticket, but thanks for the information. <laughs> from that minute, talk to him, from that minute, talk to him. You understand? <laughs> mm. Can you know say you know say America take away visa though? I'm lying. Yeah, yeah man, Warren Clark can't come to America man. Them take away visa man. <laughs> my one expert on him, Sanko. Cause the man, hey, when Sanko did that, uh, Marine and him that narcotics and boy, I'm not a thing with the man they do man. You, can, you understand? But you don't know the police yeah, was corrupt enough because him still get promotion even after that. Cause my assistant commissioner. Well, yeah, but I don't know a long time I don't hear about Sanko. I don't know if he's still in our work. He used to do a party on our one time. Mm. Then, 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 you know, so when Sanko live uh, over, uh, our live uh, Portmore. Then, you know, so Sanko did that. Uh, I don't know if I don't lie, I don't tell him anything. He did, did rape all that woman and the one only for something on him. Uh, How are you brother in yeah. him? Sinclair, I think, because Sinclair did cover it up for him and him thing. Ne? And then, man, I see the man that gets soup. Red Sanko, he's not talking. Yeah, man, I know, I know, man. Oh God, so you go still. <laughs> what me have if you know say you 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 do it without fear or fear no, or friction? You just you just highlight the things them and just hope that whatever you're doing can really no. I just change you what I, I change you what yeah because look here as me tell a man yeah mm. because all of the all of the teeth in soup them were in our police force them now you know. You understand? And mm. them feel like they might do things that uh, all of the big and I uh, get where. I uh, look at young police and them for record them and them thing there and the people them. You understand? Mm. Just, uh, just like how all the other day, I um some youth at Manchester contact me and say, My uh, Michael Phillips, that I'm um, Peter Phillips boy. I tell them uh, pay them pay them for, for, for move um the thing there, the, the, the fence in them for the highway we got put. I'm tell you them say record them and send it to me. You understand? Oh, oh, what? We got someone show up at the shop. Yeah, the, pe- the late, because I want people for dead. Oh, they, I saw the man they wicked in oh, the man. You understand? Oh, God Almighty, man. Eh. Mm, and I saw no. I mean, we always went to the man, so I could never be unemployed in a Jamaica, you know. Me. Mm. Could have never been employed. I mean, I always look at it and say, you know, I feel, I know one way you can lose the work as a police leader, you know. Mm. But you just have to be careful. True. Or you can do some, something indiscretionately and it toss you out of subconscious of your mind and you do something. So why, 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 when I tell you why, if you encourage, like what you need, so you, what you call it, young police? Yeah, man. I why young if you po- enc- mm. encourage, no, you start one program and encourage the young police them to make their self-marketable, get an additional skill. Get additional qualification. It no must have to be academically, but something where they can survive after mm-hmm. in case there's an eventuality. And if not even in case of eventually, they must prepare their mind and their self for separation from the force at some time, whether by retirement or resignation. But then for prepare themselves for go out there and then for ensure that they have a skill that can um 
you know, carry them through our, our, our faith for their idol hours. Mm. Yeah, man. Eh. Hey. Yeah, go on well, man. You're, going, you're doing very well, brother. And keep it up here, sir. Yeah, man. And, mm. and you're 10 years before me, me really let go of things still, though, you know. <laughs> yeah, I, I talk okay. about, no, no, I talk about after me, you know, after me, my migrate. I nearly 10 years. Hey. It is just hard for me to find anything, because you love it. Hard. Yeah, yeah, hey. mm. Mm. You're just passionate about it because you have a purpose. Yeah, tell you, man. Mm. Oh, hey, the brother who work, work, work at the general office named Cameron. Me rock stone. <laughs> Blago. Yeah, man. If you want big a, mouth Cameron. Yeah, man, if you want a number for you, man, them thing there, you know. Yeah, man, I want a number for you, man. Mm. Blago, Blago, man. Blago, Cameron, man. Mm. All right. <laughs> you, you have in contact with him? Yeah, man, I have a number for you, Blago, man. Then Blago, eh, Blago, 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 Blago um, do things on the channel and tell you some things about, um, I'm telling you about, um, about, the, about, about the, the, the death squad I want to be, you know, Primus, you know. Primus. Primus, yeah. Blago. Mm. Blago. All right. You must have followed the your story with Beaches Stout. Yeah. Business when I put mm. Blago. Buy one car from Beaches Stout. Mm. For $3,000, one, 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 one Camry. Mm-hmm. Tell nobody that you know Beaches Stout. I work with this man and they say, just come on. One Camry from Beaches Stout for $3,000. Mm-hmm. I'm borrow about the money from Beaches Stout. Absolutely, <laughs> man. Borrow about the money from Beaches Stout and do him pay him back. So if you go, if you go help Beaches Stout, <laughs> call him and ask him, man. Tell him how you know Fab's still about this. Hey, 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 well, hey. 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 <laughs> That's the name number. <laughs> Yeah, man, send me a number, but me can't hey, hey, no, no, me never, hey, me never hear, hey, hey, no, between me, I, 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 hey, me never hear nothing like this, so you say, <laughs> me can't tell you, well, you say, him buy, him buy money from, from BG Stout, no, him buy the care from BG Stout, and then borrow back the money, what? I don't pay about the man. I know. I want 3,000 Capri, one yellow and brown, four Capri, two door Capri. The whole way you jolly drive, every minute you brought down a road power with power. So when you understand nothing about driving this, every minute you brought down a car by a tire and punch. Yeah. Them tell me, them tell me, which one, which one your camera on station? Port and Tony Police Station. We live in a, we live in a open barrack room. We call it, this is Spanish Town Road. Mm. <laughs> Try dirty like a Spanish stone road to Rati. That time we got Delmar Theatre. Mm. Mm. That time, all right. Let me tell you, then 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 man, three thousand dollars only for money. Now let me tell you, blago save your money. One movie, one of brothers come up with Antonio Condo and show when name Club Paradise. Mm -hmm. And blago say, now nah, we save money to Rati. I, I think you know, eight is that you know. Yeah man, eight is man. Yeah man, remember that movie there man. Yeah. I'm by the car mm -hmm. from Beaches Stout. And we have you up and down, man. And come on, can we can buy gas, can buy tea. The man go back up and buy $3,000 from, from Beaches Stout. Ever than <laughs> McDonald's. No. So, Ever than McDonald's don't get it back. So, so Beaches Stout never try to get back your money from him? No, he didn't get it back. No, he didn't get it back. No, he no, 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 never try to contact your man to get back your money. They didn't ask him every day, man, and he can't get it. I pay a promise him I get, man. <laughs> But a long after, but a long after now, mm. me and you say, in the belief that we know some things we might do, but we don't know. Oh, so that... She used to come up to Port Antonio and to, to when he boy me. Mm. Come every Tuesday. So we think I just visit him and visit him friend, but a long after that, we... I judge him and do it. Oh, that's that, that I bought, we, we, we come from uh, Bahamas. Yeah, man. Mm. We win it, but we... we we did just naive to it. We didn't know how I was going. Oh, same thing. Oh, same thing. Couldn't know on them things. So that's why I'm not in the bad pressure and for your money. He yeah, asked me, but you know, put on a whole heap of pressure, man. Mm. So, so black, so I can't send him my money and I'll pay him for your liar fee, man. I <laughs> send, send him number, man. <laughs> I'm going to call him right, you know, man. I'm going to call him mm. right, you know, man. Wow. I asked him about it too when I talk to him. So, yeah. But, I'm going to keep a link with you here, brother. Yeah, but so, hey, so, hey, so, 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 hey, so, Pen, so, where, 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 the police, where, the police, where they get shot with DK and Crippley, where, 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 him name? 
Garland. Ah, oh, Williams, Desmond Williams. Oh, oh. so what? Uh, what team? Uh, then? Me no know because I'm in the dinner one with you for half a three day now. <laughs> Why? And I, and I because a thief, so a thief, a thief, let me not go to you and get that up. Hustling, man. Hustling to a thief. Hustling. So all them, so all, all authority, so all them, no, so all them, them, them put them on duty, or what? They don't get no time. 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 They don't yeah, man, then straight like Arrow, man, and, and Mr. Dwight, Mr. Um, Daya. Mm. Yeah. All right. So, all, the, so, all, so, so, all, so all, the, all they never put back DK in a uniform for that? Well, they can get assistant, you know. Never go back in a uniform. Mm. Me tell us, you see, teeth in me, they no work out, no, no, no. No, man, me I tell you, man. Me I tell you. Me me a Affleck, all right, trail with the dung and hunts me, you have Fabs, Fisher, You have Affleck number two, you know? Where the Portland Affleck come from, too? Um, in, no, he come from St. Thomas. Oh, I see, okay. Wilbert Affleck. Mm. Me, so, me, me, add, me add a three police group, you know? You want me to add a three police group? Wonderful, man, wonderful. For some time, I'm there alone, and I hear from nobody. All right, That's sir. That's how I'm man. Yeah, man. Mm. Hey, you know, so when I tell you, we go for Agri Park Road, you know? Yeah, Affleck. Um, Affleck just yes, man. In I bet for truck, the man. Where, 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 where? How are you so driving? Where one black brother usually drive? We can't remember. If a post, then usually call him. A post, man. Yeah, man. He must. He must. He must. He must. Man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Boy, hey, yeah, what man. a what a man, dirty man. He never clean yet, you know. Jesus. <laughs> and he, you can't talk to him. Hey, wait. Okay. Okay. I know, say, I know, say. man, number one uniform will come from. Clean and still dirty door. Then I borrow a half lick barrel truck just to come off a driving course, man. I'm barrel truck and we go up a one laundry in the upper Ablick Road, the road, man. Mm. And I blaze back for the come down, you know. <laughs> you saw no reach down around, we don't have run about this and half lick name the third in a big phone and it swing, it swing, swing, you know. Mm. In goes half a second and you know, catch you know, you know, so we try to go right over the road about there and drop a gong, so boogaloo, boogaloo, boogaloo. <laughs> and if the truck not turn over, mm. we have to yell up with the road. Yeah, man, we have to go past the cliff, man. Mm. I reckon I have to take the copy truck, the van and carry it back in a station, a big phone, everything and an eating lick out. So what, so what, so, uh, them don't have to nothing? They don't do a flick nothing, man. Then tell me, you yeah, did a one woman down there near Lola, 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 Evans. Lola, Lola, Evans. Lola Evans. I miss, I miss Brown getting man. Mm. Art, oh, she artist, get, she dead, you know? Artist getting dead, you know? Really? Eh? Long, eh artist That's getting yeah, man. dead, man. She dead after Tony, you wait, man. Remember, she's in there with Baba getting on. Boy, I should have killed Baba getting with Bun with Charlie. You Come remember Charlie? Eh, eh. And yeah, man, and Charlie, drink your mad enough. Man, me I tell you, man, uh, hey, but you know, say I want pretty woman still do. Yeah, man, with all the gray hair there. Mm, yeah, man. Mm. And she not bad police too for your woman, you know. Yeah, man, one time, one boy did thump in her eye up a ugly park road, there, man. And she lick him with her. Oh, you mean if he get liquid? Yeah, man. Get liquid, man. <laughs> man. And you know, say uh, I want, you know, say I want woman police remind me an artist getting, uh, was a detective side and she named Claudia Green, you know, I'm black girl, but boy. At Ellington, them, uh -huh. I see Ellington, them, them, them mash up her career, me understand, so she couldn't get no inspector or nothing. She left for work and oh, her America. He used me to talk to her, you know. You know, I'm pretty, uh -huh. one pretty black girl and them thing there, you know. Mm -hmm. eh. But she did bad to man like like artists getting. But the police was okay. Eh, the police was. Eh, the, eh, look, you, you know swear the man them do. Them not a detective. Them not a detective on the street again. Cause them the uh, uh, the, the PMP the PMP them use Ellington. How much the police was and see them a theme thief in there for them bring come in. Eh. You understand? Me tell you, so them broke all, when me down at home today, man, them broke all place in a line in a cell, man, they in a cell, me go up up in avenue, go find the goods, them in a man. Mm. Hey, you know, them type of work, they not go on again, man. Oh, God, man. All out of hack shit, lay in there, man. Yeah, I see. This one, this one sitting out there. Yeah. Me, me, I'm never answering this fine one. I think I will find the first M16 in a Jamaica, you know. You know, same so they do. Right, uh, Bevan seems to be dead. Yeah, man. A boy, you can't really know say that. You can't know say that in touch with nobody, man. Bevan seems to be dead, man. No. Hey, I'm not really in touch. I'm just the side of the world, I'm not better. Mm. Mm. 
Send a flip number, come give me a man. I had me to the group, man. Yeah, man, me send you a flip. Me add it to your group on them, but you see a different number, you know. Me add it to your group. All right. Mm. All right. Bless up yourself here, brother. I will be in touch, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Me, right. I, I'm like, me like the story about with DK, man. You say, man, then go rob on the man, them, them, <laughs> them shot them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Alright, Africa no about it in here, you know, ask him about it, you know. Me know man, Africa in a group, man. Me Africa talk and Africa did that. Me, and, me used to direct traffic out at three miles there, you know. Mm. With Juna, what to Juna, Thomas? Selassie. Juna. He's supposed to retire now. Hey, 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 so then call him Selassie. Be, be, no, man, you talk, yeah, no, Selassie, you talk, um... Oh, what do you mean? Fraser, Fraser, we call Selassie. No, man, a Jonathan. Uh, Jonathan uh, was uh, the original Silas. Yeah, man. Oh, okay. didn't get beat not I didn't get beat not actually in already. I can't ask him out in and then go to the rest. Who beat you up? Jonathan Thomas. I thought we don't know who. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Pitch up some rats, phone, and now in a yellow gang, and look out to have it clean. We don't know where to go. How much money you max it uh, again? Not at two, two miles. Two miles. Yeah. Two miles, man. Yeah, man. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Boy, I'm Kylie in the stinking, uh, man. Oh God Almighty, man! We have no, no different car it actually. And you, you got this, you got this go look girl as young police. Me and Juna Thomas. So I walk, we walk for us here. Walk, we walk, go there. Well. You are here, we reach back at us here. Mm. Run. We couldn't come to three miles, you know. We have to take it down Bell Road, you know. Run Bell Road. We have to go and take car and come up back. Marcus Garvey driving. Oh, oh, you couldn't come to three miles. Because the man then up a feet up a pin and a fling stone after we see him, man. Mm, from what? Ooh. Yeah, man. Hey, but we know we never strap. Oh. We never strap them time then, so we don't have to run, man. Mm. Yeah, man. Well, I'm not even. I'm one of them, man, where they talk about both. Bo, bo, what's when you go pick up Jimbo? Jimbo, you get shot. Bo, we never bat it to blood clot. Mm, and, and, what? <laughs> but that's why, <laughs> hey, you hear me talk all the while. That's why I don't like thief in police, you know? No, sir. I don't like thief in police, man. <laughs> yeah, I understand. You never know, say DK. Although, see me always use, uh, between me and you still, you know, you know say, I'm a, he's a man from Greenwich, you know, a brother named Steve, his father, you know. Him, they tell me, say, you see the police, Mr. Porter, I want thief, you know, Mr. Watts, that thief in police. <laughs> hey, uh, well, all right. We usually go to the father bins, you know, but I know everybody could have go inside, you know. Mm. We usually first sit down in a vehicle on the father bins when we hand in the man, they go down there, you know, for some reason, I don't know. Why? Never can go in a... Well, I don't know. But we just a reflect how when we usually go down, down, down a Greenwich farm, down a father bins, we have to out a door. Mm. Mm. And you know, say, you know, say, man, the commissioner of police could have passed the two brothers, though, you know, though? Eh, yeah, eh. Yeah. 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 But yeah. hey, you see, you see the latest video with him and him thing that a picture with him, Fabs. I don't get shake your hole up so. Well, I no, no must I seen it, I seen it, no man. Wickedness in it. Sin man, sin man, sin. Yeah, yeah man, wickedness yeah. man. I wickedness that what him do when him a commissioner of police he make the PMP them stay in a power. Them wicked, yeah, them, inno them innocent people that were there that <laughs> evilly at them blood at them the eye water the pan him man. God, eh, you God. know saying so. He used to station in Poland to try to burn down Manchani police station. I said, get chance to get out of the Eh, how him try to burn it down? Come in, him to kill a man down there. Come in, hey, look here, me and him be tight, you know. Come in, him to kill all a man down there. The first man him killing him, 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 him tell me, you know, him kill a man in him, run, you know, at the same place as Poland, you know. Mm. Mm. Come here, him be tight, you know. Me and him on the man. Me know him from here, Kelly, you know, for 87 and them things. Me and him be tight. And guess what? Okay. So me know, yeah, you know, but is it true when me when after you know you, you don't run a man and you realize one and two little things. Cause when him get commissioner of police, me did that foreign. I told okay. you before I told you before him left in you know, me and him talking you know, me go straight up by my office and see me. You know. He said me I first man yeah. ever come my commissioner office, you know. And I make no appointment and see come get to see commissioner, you know. Mm. Mm. But I feel him feel so boy, me must see, you know, true me know him know some no holy prime secret them, you know. All right, you never know. You, all right, you didn't hear about the one, the next one when they done there when you Albert Fabs, A.A. Fabs. No, hey, when hold on, hold on. Well, hey, before, before you go no further, the inspector will come from, um, him come from Portland when he come, come tell Fabs and Fabs let them, and, and Fabs and Tilford let them kill him. I stop that. What's name again? In Berry a Sentan. Then, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Yeah, talk about Glenford Hardy. Yes, man, man. 
Add the, add, mm. add them the eye water the pan him, man. You know, say, where you say, what, what are the cars of kill him? Remember, say, uh, then, remember, say, uh, I just see him quote business at Portland, where they come up, where they come up, um, you know, police did uh. involve Harry Bongs and a whole heap of police all owing clunies. Clooney, um, mm. Clooney when a deputy commissioner of police and uh, Clooney was the man mm. with Clooney was the man with what did what did um can you know say actually been charged of security him did him the talk about it and then Fabs can I remember say Fabs and the whole of them and them down there a friend and then them they give mm. Walcott Brown um Walcott uh, after what them give Walcott Brown for investigate so the inspector um, before everything did blow up hard uh, he did contact Fabs you know Catch him no for him, him mm. no for the inspector. I remember said the man they mm. be the police, you know. So him no yeah, man, talk to him like home, he, like home he attack and Fab tell him say boy, if you come come meet him at a certain time, and I eat and I eat, uh, that I would be like after working hours. But true yeah. him no, but true him a street police and not a bad police like uh. all me no mother said no sir. Me not go up him office them time there. And the man, the man go up there and uh, not knowing say Tilford Johnson involved in a coke business too. And him go there mm. and, and tell him all I police them name. And by the time he left the commissioner office and drive, reached down a Mountain View Avenue. And uh, them mm. as, some, as some of Danai Williams boy them use and kill him. Remember say man, him yeah. stop and stop there, a man is holding him back of him vehicle. Him, him, no, him mm. say a country him work, him no, he, 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 a bad police. And the man in the mm. shoot him and kill him. You know, remember that case eh, with him? Yeah, man, but in, in, in the bright, you know, in bright, bright, when I was in, do, in no administrative work, but as I say, man, no, 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 no but, street police. No, no, bad police. Yeah. yeah, man, so you know, say, mm -hmm. I, 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 them, I, them make him kill him, man. I see him quote business, make yeah. him dead, you know, Cause, because he might try to be a good police. And I saw him lose yes. his life. Mm. Mm. Me, 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 me go to the funeral down a sentence, brother. Yeah, man, yeah, man. The funeral down there, man. And the whole of them come down there in a helicopter and start to sit like that so they don't know about it. And then them kill him, man. Uh, Fab, Sabs and Tilford Johnson, them kill him. Because so Danai Williams, them, uh, Danai Williams, them use, them, Danai Williams, boy, them use some out of Issa and kill him. They nothing they take him gun. They just kill him because they said they take him gun. Mm. Mm. So that's Jesus what, 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 I said, I said, I said to myself, say, boy, you know, I have to do a video about him because a whole heap of wickedness him to steal like when he's a commissioner of police, you know, with the coke business, you know, no whole heap, you know. Oh, God Almighty. Yeah, tell him, man. Yeah, man. That one, in, you know, say, that one is not going to show you, you know, because he had added a bridge, you know. Mm. You, have, you have any yeah, picture, you have, has... you have any photo of him? No, but um, I think Mr. Nava put up a photograph of him with him in a, when he's birthday, you know. Send it, send, it me, send it to me, man. Because I tell you, man, I do all a story about it, you know. The man come yeah. tell the commissioner of police, but the police are involved in a drugs business. Not knowing, say, not knowing, say, him a report to the man, the man who is in charge of what go on, the corruption. And I saw him lose him life. Because him... Yeah, I can't... I'm going to get a photograph of Nava. Mm. Nava, eh. Yeah, man. Oh, so, God, so, you know, so you never didn't know say a police kill him. And them, let's say, so I, I commission our police until for John to set him up. He depend on the channel, no, so you know, he depend on the channel, man. Yeah, man. Eh. Mm. Alright, I'm going to find it. Me rat him. That's why I tell you. That's why, that's why, that's why I tell you. Alright, look here. Me witness some things in our police force and them things. Uh -huh. right? um, that's why I that, that's why me in a Philip, you know. Because in our mm. police force, you know, if you're not corrupt, you know, you can't, you can't advance, you know. Or you have to be, you have, yeah. you have to be, you have to be in a some form of corruption. Whether a man, a man a play with your own deer or something, uh, you understand what I'm saying? What, 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 what rank you, you leave at? Inspector, seventeen years, me spend as a constable, you know. Uh, well, uh, that, uh, that me do, uh, you know, say, I uh, pretty much uh, that me do too, you know. I mean, was a cadet. Me, sp me spend seventeen years as a constable. Mm. I me pass, me pass grade, me, me pass a grade one, you know. I'm passed on grade two, and our inspector with the day, and he and Raymond showed them, and it's dangerous like us, you know. And Raymond showed tell myself to apply for permission to go speak with the committee, to seek permission to do grade three exam. And then I see him, see him, Francis Fowler, see me, I try to embarrass, embarrass authority. With what? And then said, I must, because me apply for permission to do sergeant exam. And then said, I must go back to Portland. Now when I come back to Portland, that was a Thursday, Friday, then call me and tell me, say, I get inspector. Just straight and inspector? Then when the truck, 
Look, so I get um corporal. Oh. And then um and then about two months after that me get um three months after that me get sergeant. We don't and do when the, the truck We don't do any exam. Yeah. Yeah man. And then when the truck turn over up a um up a rare grande and kill the fourteen people them. Mm. And everybody come over. I me mean, investigate the accident there. Man. Mm. Um <laughs> then, then give me inspector. And there, there is nobody in Jamaica who investigate fatal accident with more fatality than me. Mm. I mean, investigate fatal accident with 14 people dead. We investigate fatal accident with 11 somebody dead. All of that are Portland, you know. When they chuck the turn over for Rio Grande Valley, and when they chuck the plunge in the sea out of, out of East Portland. So, so, <laughs> me, 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 so, let me ask you anything. Um, when 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 you get the car from where you the station? A Portland you the station them time? Eh? Yeah, my station in Portland I ride bike. Oh. Eh. Right. I say it go on because you never have no godfather and them thing. I want to tell you say when me go talk <laughs> when, when me talk to him that I told you before him left as commissioner of police, you know. Them time I the pan leave for years, you know. And when me talk eh. when me talk to him, you know. Remember, say, it's a man, it's a man, I know, you know, when we know good, you know, you, say, you understand. But because, you see, yeah. you see, when I say no, I'm good, it's a man, I know, when that the man used to come out on speed, when he used to come, because on speed, you hear him come from, you know, he used to request, you know, say, if, and me and one next brother named Bobby Red Zimo and for bodyguard, you know. And we used to, mm. there with him, whether at Greenwich or um, Whitfield Town, I remember a business place, along Guard Avenue and Walton Park Road. And we have to, I was uh. still there with him, you know, until he leave, you know. So when I'm driving a uh, uh. bicycle, we are ride, go back on speed, you know. <laughs> now, tell you, yeah. So when him get commissioner of police, when him get commissioner of police, I'm telling him that foreign pan leave. So him now, you know, two uh. days before him left, you know, you understand? He must say, boy, all of them is thing the way my is, I see you report them from south. He never did know, say, I mean, because him know, say, them they tell him, say, boy, I may migrate and them thing there. So I tell him, say, me never migrate still. You know, me, me uh. migrate, but me never migrate, because I'm still in a serve. So here man said to me now, two days before, say, boy, I can't believe. Kai man said to me, say, say, boy, you know, Porter, I can't believe, say, boy, you can't see him here. Here man said mm. to me now, say, boy, you know, I call, me call Mr. Amos. At that time, he said to me, I call Mr. Amos and find out if he's still at work. And, cause, when I go to him, for him make me get back my pay. Because I go back at work, I go back at work, you know. Uh. And I go back sickly for more than 180 days and them thing, like, injury and duty. And them time, you know, when they were commissioner of police, you couldn't go back and work them time, you know, because a dictator thing, they were going no, on. No, 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 no. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, me are the only, me, me are the only person who <laughs> go back and work after 180, 80 days. When I'm a commissioner of police, I get me, me go mm -hmm. back and work the Wednesday and get paid the Thursday. Because you understand? That's a, you know, see. Yeah, mm. I just phone call him to the mix. Yeah, man, because him tell me, mm. him, him call a woman and them things, and I say, make certain, so I get me paid. So I get back, I get uh, about $2 million, I get back, you know. After tax and mm -hmm. thing, then, yeah. Mm. Mm. But when he might tell me now, say, boy, he might say, he might call Amos, if he ask, ask Amos if he's sti um, still around. I mm. tell him, say, mm -hmm. I say, boy, you know, but chief, what you, <laughs> I say, you know me better, I say, Amos. I say, boy, I know he's a work and them thing. So I say, then, mm. you know, you don't have to ask, you don't have to ask somebody that and them thing. You, you depend on your way out. And that's something you get for me, mm. that Lucius Thomas, because, you understand, when he's in inside there, um, Lucius, because I'm alone, about two of me and him in there, and we all talk and him had a lunch. And I'm telling me, say, in the office, mm. lonely. I first remember going to the commissioner office up there. Mm. Yeah, that's I want to go in the commissioner's office there one time, too, you know. One <laughs> funny situation where I go in there, too, you know. Mm. Him, him, you know, my brother, when he's um, McDonald, uh, Laban McDonald. Yeah, well, him, him, I think he left as the assistant commissioner or something like that, no? Eh, eh, a Portland income from to you know, mm. in my Walcott Brown. Um, Bruce Golden, I come to Portland. Mm -hmm. When we go to East Portland, go meet them, you know, one whole heap of labor right there out there, and then uh, behave themselves, you know. Mm. The road block up, and I can't get the, the, can't get the Prime Minister to come up front. Mm -hmm. I go to Darrell Vaz, and I tell Darrell Vaz, and I ask him to talk to the labor right there along the road, that I can't get to carry out the, the VIP. Oh, we have the road in there, you know. Can't get to come down there. I can't go down there. Pan the bike back and then talk to the people, them. Help me clear the road, them. For you know, politician and rule. Mm. 
I go back now, I go back to me. Cam go back up by the top of the line. Bring out those gold in Cam Road and we go on with the motorcade. I see LeBron McDonald out there with the, with the camera right now. He call Lucius Thomas and tell Lucius Thomas say, he see me out that campaign with Daryl Vass from back back. Mm. Hey, so the, the deputy super name, um, Brown, when we that first say there. Oh, him dead, him dead, yeah, yes. Dada Brown. Him dead, yeah. Hey. Apo, Dada Dada Apo, Dada Apo yes, come from him? No, he come from Portland, come work. Mm. He said, if me that car, um, Daryl Vass from the back back, he said, say, Jesus Christ, I can't tell nobody so. He said, but how I not can't tell nobody so. And I see Le- Le- Leban um, out there to photograph. Mm. I go down and um, Lucius Thomas asked me, say, what was the city, what the cost of do that? Mm. And I tell him, and he said, look, you know, go back and put them, go work here, man. Yeah. So, so that about why, <laughs> that's why me, that's why you know I'm right thing you do on them things like why you don't lie about that for. But yeah, you, me not lie about it. Yeah, but hey. you true McDonald in my my true in most my big big PMP, you know, you understand? Yeah man, hey, I didn't see Darrell Vaz. But me don't know Darrell Vaz because of politics neither. Because me work for Darrell Vaz, me work for the jet ski them. Mm. I don't know if they can call me, I'm to work for them, young. Yeah, so, you know, we have come to the end of, um, you know, this conversation that we had with that um, former police officer, you know, so, what you have listened, you know, these an- anecdotes shed lights on a data aspect of law enforcement in Jamaica and underscore the dangers of corruption within police forces. You know, so, the first incident highlights how some police officers abuse their authority for personal gains. En- engaging in illegal activities such as extortion. I don't know how a policeman do that. Oh, you know, you're supposed to be upholding the law and then you are shit down people. And I know DK what's the, you know, as I, you know, I heard, I said, um, you know, during the conversation with the police officer, when I went to Hunsby, I thought DK Watson was the baddest police officer in Hunsby. You know? I was to realize that him and another one named Barry McCray, Mr. B, he passed away years ago. I told I told joke at them, you know, them just look wicked, but them not. And when the man with them extended clip, remember me tell you, you know, that baby, them, you know. And however, their action ultimately led, led them into a dangerous situation, showcasing the risk with such misconduct. So I don't know how them never kicked them out of the police force, you know, for go on. Um, you know, illegal activity then, as you, you know, the man said that. Um, they did not put them on duty because our crime them go commit. You understand? So why I, I, them police are the thief though, you know. But it's still happening even to this day. So the second story, you know, illustrate from you know, another form of corruption. Uh, you know, I say as Jamaican you know, I say boy, him general, him general beat his stuff, but as you heard the man says now, to beat his stuff now, yeah, he's a convicted murderer right now. Convicted um about two weeks now for killing his first wife. And the reason why he's convicted in it is because this man is a greedy man. No, his second wife. The reason why he's convicted for murder is because he's a greedy man. Yes, um, he had promised the the man that he hired to kill his wife that he's going to pay him three three million dollars. And the reason why he killed his wife, you know, is because uh, a policeman. Yes, a policeman was having a relationship with his wife, and you know that them beat the start them mad the policeman where they give him them put cooking or something that him drink. That's why he must be licky licky and love drink and eat as police. And mad him. So him, that policeman is a madman now, walking up in a port and tone. You understand? Barefoot and all of these things. He used to, he used to have an affair with Beatty Stout's wife. Why the man the wicked still doing you know? him? They never mash up the youth, but why? You know. Yeah, so, yeah, criminal, you know, so, yeah, so as you, you know, so, yeah, bam, Cameron now, you know, Cameron, smart police, but I mean, you know how him did. By the care for, but because BT Stout now was involved in the furious thing. BT Stout was involved in drugs back then. So BT Stout that thought that the police knew that he was involved in drugs. So that's why BT Stout never tried to get back his money. So, you know, that, um, not only does the officer accept the vehicle from, you know, the drug dealer then, BT Stout. But he also fears to replay alone, essentially benefiting from criminal activity. But I, I never know the police get care from people free by camera or something else. So these narratives emphasize the importance of integrity and accountability within law enforcement agencies. You know, corruption erodes public trust and jeopardizes the safety and well-being of officers and civilians. 
it's underscored the need for a robust mechanism to prevent, detect and address corruption within police forces to uphold the rule of law and ensure justice for all. Yeah, you see, as a police officer, at the same time, people have respect for you and your office. Yeah, and, and nothing nice and nothing. You, know? yeah, you feel good because people were like, uh, yeah, this is a good man. Um, you know, this policeman is not a thief. And that is, you know, it, it, it's best if somebody say, oh, boy, you said a policeman, eh? Uh, him did, um, you know, boy, him did, is a man still there, him nearly killed me one time and him beat up a whole heap of shot off of me and because you're a criminal, you understand what I'm saying, I have to run and boy, because him left for work, that's why them not get to chat, them not even charged because and all kind of thing. It's best that somebody said that about you, but it's when somebody said that you're a thief in police, that is not good, man. I am telling you, my brother and sisters. You know, I, you know, so many times you hear people say all kind of things about police officer. But it's shocking to hear that though, DK, right? Um, I heard the story with DK, but I didn't, I thought that the policeman had died, but, and, you know, based on what I heard, I did not know it was a robbery that DK them went on an extortion out by two miles, and that is really, really sad. As we say, when I like thief in police, and DK know that too. So, have yourself a beautiful day. Jamaica, Young Police Channel, out.